Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to set up your Motorola MB86 cable modem, so here we go. First thing you want to do is go ahead and find a co uh, coaxial cable outlet, go ahead and plug that in. If you're uh, putting it directly into your computer, hopefully you have a long cable, or if you're using a Wi-Fi router, it doesn't really matter because the router is going to do the work for you. So go ahead and plug in the other side to your cable modem. And then if you want to make it tighter, there's a supplied wrench with the package. So you can you know, use that to make it tighter if you want. Then go ahead and plug in your power. So I put in my surge protector here. And make sure that the uh, cable modem is powered off. The default setting is off with the button sticking out. But make sure it, it is off. Once you plug in the power, then go ahead and put in your Ethernet cable and then plug in the other side to either your computer or your router. Uh, your router should be powered off right now as well, so make sure that is off. Once you do that, then go ahead and turn the modem on and you'll see a bunch of blinking lights. Motorola mentions it should it could take up to 15 minutes. It only took about five minutes in my case, so it's just gonna be blinking like this, getting set up. And then you'll see that it's gonna be solid. You'll see the blue globe is gonna be solid, the DOCS is 3.1, so hopefully you've got that as well. Once you do that, then go ahead and power up your router or turn on your computer. And then you'll see the ethernet cable icon either blinking or be solid. So the next step is to either, if you're on your computer, go to the supplied website by your ISP to activate the modem. Or in my case, I have Xfinity, so I use the app, go to the top in the icon, go to activate modem, and then say, hey, I have my own modem. So hit that, and then let the app do its thing. You wanna start activation, you wanna click next. Next, ready to go. And then let's find your CM Mac number. This number is located on the bottom of the modem. So there you go, you can see it. Obviously I'm not gonna show you mine, but uh, you'll have your own number. So go ahead and plug that in. Once you do that, hit next, and then do check connection. So then let the app do its thing to activate the modem. Uh, they mentioned it takes, it could take up to five minutes. It only took about a minute in my case for this uh, you know, process to work. And then you just do continue to Xfinity. And you'll see at the top it says offline, but the modem um, right now, I kind of missed this. It was the blue globe was blinking for about a minute and then it went solid. And then after that, then the modem was working. So about 10 minutes later, you just can see at the top says MB86 online. So <clears throat> that's how you know that the modem is good to go and is working. And that's basically it. Then you should be able to get on the internet. So as you can see, I had 106 download before. And then now I've got 336 with this new modem. So I know it's working. Um, it could be even faster, but I have a kind of an old router. So that's for another video. But anyways, hope this video helped you. If it did, don't forget to comment, like, share, and subscribe. And thanks for watching.